Listen, that tissue's here or I'm not. <clears throat> Your Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Felt like I needed to do this one big day of organising. It needs to be that way or we can't do it. But is that not just a fancy way of giving yourself an excuse not to do something? Because, right, I went to a wedding last night, wrapping Eminem at 1.30 in the morning, driving home. Have you ever laughed someone so much you give an armful? Like the expression, no, literally give an armful. Basically, I'm so tired is what I'm trying to say. It's 28 degrees and can I be bothered? Hell to the no. Obviously got a fit child in this flat, so we need to get rid of some stuff. Africa. That headboard's got to go. I'm trying to sell it, no one wants to buy it. I want a cream one. And yeah, these are my little wall plates from Africa. They're like wickery, like that, and like that. And over here, you got my new pyjamas, love these, these are from H&M, I will link them. This is all going, need to sell this chair, giving this to my little sister. And this, again, da, 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 Africa. Some people might think these are scary, but I like, like, oh, you know, like the black lines, and then the black lines in here. I'm gonna make like a little baby station thing here, and we, do, we need to look, we need to, we need to sort this out. <laughs> oh, yeah. Here we've got more bloody orders to take back to the post office. Anyone else die every time they go in with so much? Because it's actually so embarrassing. Oh my God, is that what I think it is? I'm sorry, but I'm actually a professional YouTuber. That was like the smoothest unplanned way of saying, this video is in collaboration with none and only. None only? The one and only. <laughs> Hello Fresh. Keep watching to see my meals. I've actually already had one and, oh, honestly, I want it again. I still haven't made my Hello Fresh meal card thing. Don't think I've showed you this plant, but here's the little middle bit. And then look what we finally have up. Five months later it took us. How pretty are these string of hearts? This is from Ikea. The little elephant poking out, another little elephant. I love elephants. Hippo, another mask that people might find scary. This drum. And then, oh my god, when this lit, is lit up at night, it's so cute. It's a little tea light candle thing. A photo from Africa on one of our safaris in my gob. Frank. And then this shelf is so nice. It's from Etsy. Can you see like the shape of it? So nice and obviously I sprayed these gold. Here we've got a new plant to add to the family. Look at this one, look at this leaf. Oh, how exciting. Added another row with Africa pictures on. However, one of them's broken, we need to put that back on. I showed you the black beans, right, I think. But here we've got like, instead of a horseshoe, we have the little Africa thing. So there, a little basket. Yeah, photo, cute. Okay, so I'm on a mission to maximise storage in this flat. Starting off with, love this unit, marble top, too small. So I'm gonna get one that's like goes to here. And on screen is the one I'm thinking. And I'm thinking that's gotta go. My boyfriend's always said it's so annoying. And I was like, no, it's not. And now I'm like, oh gosh, you're so annoying. Because the unit has a bit of wood in it, I can let go of that bit of wood. And it gets so dusty, like, look at that. I'm going gonna, gonna to sneeze just looking at it. I don't know if I showed you this either. This, right, is a plan. What is it called? I don't know, but to water it, you just soak it in water. So the plan is clear out all the junk, clean it, because I'm sorry. What is this, honey? That is terrible. I'm disgraced. Clean it out and sell it. That is actually feral. Might have to knock a few pounds off this. It's clean, but what even? Ah, oh, it's the paint coming off. Da -da. Dun dun dun. Uh. Uh, okay, so we've got everything out. This stuff is going. I've never used pads in my life. Very confused. Are you ready to see the state of this cupboard? Dun, dun, dun. The camera is making it look better. That is actually vile. I, I'm not even in there and I can smell the rotting squalor. I'm also about to be very on brand. Damn that organized bubble, bitch! I noticed that quite a few of my products are running very, very scarily low. On my home screen, on my phone, I actually have different lists pinned. So here's my little list up the side. So this one is a shopping list. And whenever I notice it's been low on something, I add to it. Definitely leaving that to marinate. Ugh. This is as good as it's gonna get. As you can see, they were sprayed in the back. 
left damp patches so I can't take photos of it to sell. I soaked and cleaned inside the toothpaste bot because that, that gets grabby too. How much better does that look? If you're wondering, the reason why I put everything around the edge is that everything is easy to get so it's less likely to get messed up and it just stays how it is. Before we get on with the organising, it is Hello Fresh time. I was gonna a lie and say, yeah, let me just unbox my Hello Fresh that I've just got and I've definitely not already ate one of the meals. But oh my god, it was worth it. Do you know why? Because I'm gonna go as far as to say that that meal that I ate, which I will show you, was one of the best meals, top three, that I've ever cooked in this flat. But if I was to unbox it, nothing to see here. It would come like this. The number of the meal, all the ingredients, so simple, so easy. Literally, this is why I like HelloFresh. Also, I have not even said what HelloFresh is. If you didn't know, it is basically a fresh meal kit delivery service. So you go on, you pick your meals. I've spoken about it before, but I'm just gonna tell you again if you don't know. I see it as I'm looking at a restaurant menu, but I've got to cook it myself. But because it's a restaurant menu, for me anyway, I branch out and I make things that I wouldn't make at home. And that is probably one of my favorite things about it because there's no way I'm gonna go into the shop and be like, oh, I'm gonna have a sweet potato korma style curry. I'm just gonna get the same old, same old. Do you know when you get in that meal repetitive thing? On your meal cards, you get a number, and then you get a number on the bag, simple. You do get a refrigerator bag. Obviously, I've annihilated it and I ate some of it, but it's just all the stuff iced up. I'm not gonna lie, when this got delivered, I went for a nap, I have naps now, and it got delivered, I put it on the side, I had a nap for an hour, put it in the fridge, it was fine. So Hello Fresh is fresh. The meals I went for, I always go for a rapid meal. A rapid meal is obviously, it says what it is, under 20 minutes, that's what we want. Speedy, quick. I'm actually like I cook all my meals, my boyfriend does. He does most of the cooking. And he follows these recipe cards like a dream. Do you know what I was actually thinking? One thing I love about this is when we cooked the meal that I shouldn't have already ate, he was cooking at the start, and then because we've got these cards that say all the instructions, I could just jump in and cook the rest. This is the one of choice. The speedy sausage rigatoni. Look at that. And there's all the instructions. I think this is the one I'm gonna make to show you. And here is the final curry. Look at me getting all fancy with the rice. We've mixed in our sweet potato and broccoli, so you can't see the vibrant orange and green, but it's there, okay? So this is the sweet potato korma style curry, and it was so easy to do. Here's all the instructions, literally, step by step. Simple, easy, and it didn't take that long either, half hour. I'm not even being dramatic. That is so good. That is actually delicious. Mmm. I tell you what though, folks, that's bloody nice. Oh my God. I can't believe how good that is. Just get a box just for this meal, honestly. Chicken in creamy peppercorn sauce with mash and then carrots. Them carrots. No offense, Hello Fresh, but I actually think mine looked better than that. It was delicious. Obviously, if I'm talking about HelloFresh, that means there is a good discount coming your way. Tell me everything no, now. I want to know everything. If you obviously don't want to become an at-home chef and present your meals like you're a master chef, then just click off, don't even care. There should be a QR code right here. You can scan that or the link in the description box. You haven't said the offer yet. The offer is my exclusive <laughs> discount code. 60% of your first box and then 25% of your next two months. If you're a food shop hater like me, do it. If you want to work smart, not hard, do it. If you want quick meals, do it. But also delicious, do it. Don't miss out on a good meal, deal. Deal, meal, meal and deal. Yeah, <laughs> back to the organizing. I was trying to think of what drawer I've been itching to organize, but wanted to film it for you lot, so I couldn't. And I think this one's it. Look at it, disgraceful. I mentioned in a video ages ago that this stuff is going to go into the living room. That's not happening today. So what I'm going to do is literally just get it all out, declutter it and put it back in, in, in a way that isn't like this. This draws like Mary Poppins bag. This drawer might take longer than it would take me to do my whole entire wardrobe. If anyone wants to come do this drawer for contraception, then be my guest. 
I'm staring at this thinking, where do I even begin? I'm thinking, get all these stuff grouped together, all like pens and stuff grouped together, and all the bits and bobs. I'm just making categories, I think. When I was a kid, my mum introduced me to the bin monster, and I'm thinking the bin monster needs to make an appearance because, god damn. Why do little girls have little bits and bobs? I'm telling you right now, I'm creating a freak child like I was. The grand age of like five or six would write lists of everything in my room and organise it. I've still got those lists. I think those ones are from when I'm a bit older, but yeah, I was weird. So I'm going to have to create a small weirdo. I, I'm, I'm going to get the messiest child ever. I know that's what will happen, but if I can, we're going to have to create a small organised bubble, bitch. This bit's for the bin monster. I don't mind if you take this toy, okay? Yeah. No matter how much I take out of this drawer, there's still more left. Oh my God, I thought I was never gonna see the end of that drawer. I mean, I technically haven't. Now I need to sort out all this crap. One Sainsbury's bag of rubbish later and we are done. I'm pretty impressed with that. We've got arts and crafts, bubbles. We've even got a spare container. All the little annoying toys, I'm going to call them. And then the bigger ones, Sylvanian families. I've just put them all in like a sandwich bag. And then, yeah, the big stuff. And you know how I like to make everything easy access? I have, apart from... The noisy toy. Better organised in a different place, but for now, I'm happy with this. A home update I missed is, I also want to sell these two. Obviously, before I had the luxury of not needing storage here. I'm thinking these ones I'm going to put on screen. I need to do the measurements, but I want something wooden. Mitten defeat with these lamps. Do you remember when I tried to go all DIY when I did my bedroom series and everything was going wrong? Well, the bases were fine, but I've never, ever been able to find a lampshade that goes and you might be thinking that's fine but can you see i've painted this one and when they're turned on they're the ugliest color ever so i'm just gonna have to buy new lamps i think i'm gonna do this drawer oh what was that sound <laughs> so avoid dread this might help you if you're feeling how i feel when you organize instead of being like oh the whole drawer i would literally do this little box and then this little box, and then that box, and then that box. Obviously, if you don't have little boxes, you can't do that. But what I'm saying is just break things down into small little bits. And if I don't want to finish the whole thing, I actually don't have to. Because there's no rules. But usually when you start, you don't want to stop. Or you start and you wish you never started. I'm not sure how satisfying this after is, but it actually looks so much better than before. And I've got rid of quite a lot of stuff. I really don't want to do this. But seeing as I've done this straw, and this drawer. I guess that means I've got to do this drawer. The best part about doing this drawer is that I've got nowhere to like sort it. So I'm just surrounded. So we now have one empty dusty drawer that isn't gonna get dusted. Loads of stuff. I feel pretty claustrophobic Darren to be honest. Progress. So that's all sorted. Giving this away because everyone raves about it and personally for me, I ended up getting loads of texture and spots from it. I tried it for a good while, didn't even realise it was this, was like no way, didn't even think of it. And then when I stopped using it, went back to the ordinary cleansing balm, went away. I filled up the rubbish pile more. This stuff needs to go in another drawer. And this is all the electrical stuff that I really don't want to go through to be honest. For some reason I hang on to my old hairdryer which I'm pretty sure is going to catch fire and kill me. So, actually, do you know what? Having said that out loud, maybe just get rid of it. Because, listen, if that one goes, I'm just going to have to accept that it's a slick back hair bun and I'm going straight to boots. I just realised I've lost the end of my hair dryer. That's not good. I really hope it's not in that bin because I don't actually want to look if it is. Finished. I've got to be honest with you, I didn't organise these wires and look through them and check what's what. But it's organised, so we're not going to talk about it. And look, I found the end, so my hair isn't going to get shredded. Look, why does that eyebrow look so much darker than that one? Uh, yeah, I'm done. I've organised enough. I actually feel pretty accomplished. Don't forget the HelloFresh discount. I'll put it on screen now. 60% off your first box. 25% off the next two months. Link in the description box or this QR code. 
if it's easier. I just personally don't want to be thinking about meals. I want to feel like I'm at a restaurant, even though I've got to cook it myself, but you know what I mean? I'm all about that simplified life. Anyway, give the video a thumbs up. Subscribe. I'll see you next time. Ciao for now.